Occupational English Test, Once a Day Pill to Prevent HIV. Queensland has experienced a significant increase in HIV notifications during the past year. Although the statistics are described as alarming, they have not yet been confirmed. In fact, it is difficult to know what has caused the increase. More testing of people at a high risk of HIV may have resulted in a higher number of positive results. Last year, Queensland started to offer free rapid HIV tests with results known within 30 minutes. Most new HIV notifications are among Australian born men who have sex with other men. The Queensland AIDS Council is concerned that the safe sex message is no longer effective. They claim that gay men are ignoring the importance of the safe sex message and may not see the message as relevant. In the past decade, the rate of HIV has doubled in Queensland. Three quarters of people diagnosed with HIV are men who sleep with other men. 9% of all gay men in Queensland are HIV positive. Unfortunately, more and more men report that they do not use condoms during casual encounters. HIV testing and early treatment are the cornerstones of therapy as they can lessen the risk of passing on the virus. Trials have begun in Australia of a pre-exposure prophylaxis or PREP treatment. The treatment consists of taking a single tablet called Truvada. Truvada is a combination of two HIV medications called Tenefever and Emtricitabine. The Centre for Disease Control and Prevention has recommended the use of Truvada since becoming aware of the first positive trial results. The treatment must be used in conjunction with safe sex counselling, advice on prevention methods and treatment for STDs. It is reserved for people who are at substantial risk of acquiring HIV. It is also an option for high-risk groups who refuse to use condoms. Groups of people who participate in high-risk sexual behaviors often refuse to use condoms. In the USA, the group includes young, inner-city black men who have sex with men. Also, intravenous drug users. And, heterosexual men who have multiple partners who often do not insist on using condoms. Most people in this group are unaware of public health messages about safe sex or the availability of pre exposure prophylaxis.